Hello, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Towns on the Fluffy Couch, here with your host, Stealthy Kitty, which is me, haha. I don't know why I've been doing that in the last two videos. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> uh, what have I done since we last left off? Oh yeah, nothing. Well, except for I put some beds in over here. These things are going to be the meadows and cabinets. But you need stone for these, apparently. I didn't realize that until, like, just now. Hey, can I... Mine that? No, it's water, right? I think I'll kill somebody if I try to mine this. Wait, 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 wait! Cancel order! I know how to do this. You have to have them mine the ones over the water first. I think. Okay. Come on. Oh, down. Let's not... not kill anybody. Are we getting stone back from this? I don't even know. Oh, we got two for that. I don't know. I don't think it didn't... I don't think they got stone. I don't know. Oh, hey, there's one right here. We can pick that up, too. Alright. So, we're still making bread. But, haha, -ha, there's a problem. Can anybody guess what it is? Does anybody see the problem? Minus the fact that I think everybody's running at Ronkin's slow. No. We're fine. Okay. Does anybody see the problem? Yeah. This guy's eating bread. This girl's getting stuff to make more bread. There's bread laying on the floor not doing anything. This guy's harvesting wheat to make more bread. These ladies now also need stuff to do with bread. See? Flour. She's eating bread. So, the problem here, if you didn't quite catch it, is that... Everybody's wasting way too much time worrying about the damn bread, alright? Because, see, this guy's right. See, Walter, how come every time I try to use a good example of a villager or a townie, you're always him, Walter. You just happen to be a good guy. But pretty much, we don't want this. Because if everybody's so busy worried about bread and wheat and everything else, nothing else is going to get done around here. Well, I mean, like, you can go to the... So we're going to talk about that. Organizing. Alright, so priorities panel here. So the priorities panel is simple. You can change the priority based on baking and cooking. You can move it down. See, now it's number two. And gathering and harvesting is number one. Now it's number one. So you can uh, base priorities based on this. Uh, or change priorities based on this. To make it so... People will drop everything to do this. So say bread is needed and somebody is mining. They will drop mining to go make bread if nobody else is doing it and everybody else and somebody needs to do it. They will drop whatever else they're doing to go get bread, alright? So, well, we could have them set up so they all do this. Or, we could put them into job groups. Now, when they added this, I was so excited. You might have been there if you watched my last video or my last, like, season on this. Adding jobs was, like, the best thing they could have done for this game. Job groups are brilliant. So that's what we're going to be doing today. Job group one. We're going to rename the job group into gatherers. Easy mode. So now the group is named gatherer. I can go to change jobs and I can tell them that they are not to uh they are not to mine, they're not to item construct, they're not to wall construct, they're not to bake, they are to haul. Are to haul. Don't make people not haul, that's bad. They don't feed, they don't trade, they don't build. They haul, they till, they gather and harvest, and they also don't bake. Alright, so see now these guys are going to till, chop down trees, how to save, gather, harvest, and haul. Is that is that understood? Do we know what they're doing? Now we go here, and we get to pick some lovely ladies. That's right, ladies. I'm going to be sexist. <laughs> we're going to pick some lovely ladies to do this, alright? So we're going to say, 
Okay, well, you can change their individual jobs, I forgot that. If you go to jobs, you can change their individual jobs, just like I just did in the job group, by telling them what they can and cannot do. But, I'm just gonna move them into a job group. So, job group, join job group, gather her. Oh, she's gone! Where'd she go? Well, she's here now. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Alright, so now I can scroll over and it, you see that second, that little two? It says gatherers and then two. It shows you that there's two people in this job group. Okay, I'm gonna have them auto-equipped. She's sleeping, so she won't. But they need to have... In case of a siege, they need to have weapons. I don't put armor on them first. I put armor on them last, but... Weapons. Alright, job group two. Rename to the bakers. I know, I'm being really creative. Okay, they're not going to gather and harvest. They're not going to mine. They're not going to till and chop. They're not going to do this. They're not going to do that. They are going to butcher. They are going to haul. They're not going to build. They're not going to trade. And they're not going to feed them damn animals. Because, dude, feeding animals is like wasting your own food for things that are going to die anyway. Just as an FYI. Because you're going to kill them. You're going to eat them. And you should just kill them and eat them before they waste your food. If you know what I mean. So they're going to bake. They're going to cook. They're going to butcher. They're going to haul. Ta-da! Alright, so now we're gonna go back up here. Uh, as you can tell, we only have one female left, so I can only be sexist one more time by putting her in the baker group. Now, who seems like... The old guy? Would that be... Would that be Aegis? Dude, why are there two rels? I already knew this! Hi. Now the old guy can stay. Ralph doesn't have anything in his hand. Ralph can be a baker. Ralph always wanted to be a baker, just like Pantheon. Wow. League reference. Alright. So now, ta-da! That's what's gonna happen here. But now, as you can see, everybody else still doing it. I mean, Walter's not a baker, but he's still doing it. What's up, Walter? You're not a baker. Which is making every baker... This guy? See, he says baker. When you scroll over him, he says he's fine. Which means he probably should go to the hospital and get better than fine. And he's a baker, because he's in the baker group. So, <clears throat> he has nothing to do. So he's standing there like an idiot, because he literally has nothing to do. Look at that, nothing to do. She's sleeping, but he has no task at all. Okay, now he's going to haul. Because somebody else is baking. <laughs> Alright, I think I've explained it. It's been explained. So, everybody in the normal group still bakes. They still harvest. They still do everything. So we're going to make another group. Ta-da! And we're going to call it the workers. I'm going to spell workers wrong. Workers. So this is the workers group. And their jobs are going to be they do not bake, they do not gather, they do not... they can chop and till. They item construct, they don't chop and till. <laughs> they wall construct, they haul, they build, they trade, they don't feed animals, because again, stupid animals. Okay, so pretty much they, they do the trading, they do the building, they do the hauling, they do the wall construction, they do the item construction, and they do the mining and the digging. Now we can change this later, obviously, if nothing is set in stone, you can do whatever the hell you want with whatever, pretty much. Now, I'm not going to move everybody in there, because that would be just wrong. But this guy has like one of the best weapons, it looks like. Because it's actually a stone. So he's going to be a worker. Yeah, I know. I just put an old guy in a worker. Okay, so Jeffrey is going to be a worker. And hell, why not Walter? Go Walter. And, uh... You don't have a... You don't have a weapon, so I won't worry about you yet. But you can be a, a worker. Okay, so now that's four people that aren't going to do uh, everybody else's job. So now we have two people left that are going to do everybody's job. Ta-da! But that, of course, makes it so this is going to be easier. So now we move on. Now we can tell them to do stuff more, like gather. They can gather more. But we don't need them to gather more right now. Actually, it looks like they could use a couple more gathering concepts because they have six of all these, five of them. But so we can tell them to gather more, so we will. Let's move it up to six. It's a really stupid number, six. Uh, we can tell them to make more wheat. We really don't need to. We can tell them to make sugar. Let's keep two sugar on hand at all times, alright? Why not? 
We don't need any of this stuff because we don't have animals. Not yet, anyway. We can go here. We can say, make five bread, not just two. Now we can also tell them to make pie. Here's, we can make one peach pie, and, or, a pear. <laughs> one pear pie, and one apple pie. Now this, um, it says fill, uh, 85%, eat 88. Now this, uh, fill is 75%, and it's eat is 60. I have no freaking clue what that means. Okay, wait, no, no, no. So pretty much, it fills, this one fills up more, but I think it takes longer to eat is what it's saying. So these are better-ish. We're gonna go with them. Now we have sugar and flour so we can say make a cake too. So see we can tell them to make more because we have them delegated to do just those jobs. I'm gonna talk with my pointer. Okay now we're not gonna get into meat yet because we don't have anything for meat cooking in the kitchen. As of this particular moment, and apparently somebody wants to text me. <laughs> Sorry, I just got like really quiet and I didn't even realize I did it. I was reading a text. My bad. Uh, I apologize right now. But that's pretty much all I can do, because I already did it, and I'm not going to edit it out. You guys already know that. <coughs> Alright. Let's tear this, some more of this mountain down. Alright, so we're going to tell the harvesters to come up here and harvest this. Apparently everybody's busy. Really? Nobody can come up here and harvest this? Come on, there's supposed to be two people delegated to this. <sighs> we're working on jobs today. We're explaining all the goods of the jobs. I like to have as the least amount of people in this section that is just like normal citizens as possible. So I mean, I'll have more jobs by the time I'm done, and I'll break these up into even smaller. Like I'll have the haulers where people just just haul. But once you get down into like the the dungeons and stuff, that's a really good thing to have if you have the people to do it. Because they'll just chill. And when they're sitting down doing nothing and like being happy, their happiness goes up. Which means you get more people. Ha ha. <laughs> yeah, that's right. So if their job is to haul and there's nothing to haul, they'll sit here. But, I mean, once they're done sitting here, they're going to go, Okay, we're going to move some bread. And they're going to do their job. Damn good at it, too. And that's just, uh, that is the way it works. But see, right now we got apples laying around over here. We don't have a lot of stuff just laying around. Well, besides the food, but we're just doing that, apparently. We have nowhere to put this, so this will stay here. So, I mean, yeah, we want to just, we want to just make it so everything is better. That's the plan. Everything needs to be better. So now all the workers are going to run up here, because they didn't really have anything to do. They were just kind of standing around and eating the food. Cricket, 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 cricket. Alright, we want to tell them to gather more fruit. More than... I'm going to go up to ten because that makes more sense to me. Okay. Which means we need more containers. Yeah. Oh, you know what that sound means? A trader or a caravan or whatever you want to call it. Okay, so we're going to take the prepared food barrels. And we're going to line the wall of the dining room with them. That's... Oh, oh, it's a bone guy. I don't think we have any bones. Is he ready to trade? Alright, let's see. We have nothing. Oh, damn. Ooh, he has boots of hasten. The trickster. Wow, that would be really nice to have. Obviously, it's way too expensive for any of my little townies to afford right now. And it doesn't look like we can afford anything except for, like, we could buy, like, one item. It's not really a big deal, though. And we have nothing we can sell him, so he's really kind of useless to us until we start, you know, getting dead animals. 
<laughs> then we can summon the bones from the dead animals because that's horrible but yeah that's what we do <clears throat> but yeah so we don't really need that don't really need that we're gonna get the rest of this down What am I? Wow, how high up am I? Good lord. There we go. Need to scroll down a bit. Alright, so see the prepared food barrels over here? Really nice. Fancy. I need to unlock this prepared food barrel. Because I don't want the food barrels out here. I want them inside. Now they should... They should move this. I think. I don't really remember. <laughs> they should move it. I just do not know at the moment. If I cancel this order and I tell them to put a prepared food barrel here, will they move that one down there? Come on, guys. I have faith in you. Yeah, he did it. Good job, Jeffrey. I think that was his name. Yep, Jeffrey. Okay, so now we're gonna get some furniture so these guys have some tables. Stone or wood? Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna go with the wooden tables and stuff. I mean, yeah, they're not like really fancy. That was the wrong button. I hit caps lock instead of shift. Oh well. well. <clears throat> I guess we'll put another one right there. Yeah, we're only gonna have two tables. It's okay, people don't eat at the same time that much. <laughs> That's the funniest looking. So yeah. Like, we could put another, like, little table over here. And, but we'll... People don't eat that much. Like, they... Once we get more people, this might become an issue, but, I mean, right now it's not an issue and really... They'll just stand in the kitchen, I'm pretty sure. We should never have eight people eating at the same time, I don't think. Especially with only having ten people. That would just be craziness. Crazy. Craziness. Okay. So, this is all... This is starting to get good. See, another thing I like about j breaking them all off into job groups like this is they get to the hall faster. And I just, this looks really, I don't know, crappy. It looks like they don't care about their kitchen. <laughs> they just want to leave bread laying everywhere. And I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Alright, we're going to unlock that food barrel. And then we're going to say raw food barrel we want. Do We want one here and one here. Yeah, that should be good. Because then we're going to put another baker, another oven right here. <sighs> oh no. The crash. The crash. So this is a lot of food barrels. Remember, each barrel only holds ten items. So, at any given time, right now, we can hold fifty prepared, ready-to-eat food items. Fifty. That should be good. For now. Yeah, that actually should be good for a while. Hmm. Wood's going down. We we might need to make another wood row. Maybe we'll cut down uh, this part of the mountain just a little bit. So we can make this bigger. The tree farm. Uh, you know what? I don't think I like the idea of putting that there. right there. There's like nowhere I can put it that I don't think I'm gonna be upset by it. So we'll just put it there for now. That means we can hold 20 raw food can things. Which isn't all that bad. Well we can't hold 20 yet because we don't have it but I mean yeah. So we really didn't get that far this time. Wait we talked about jobs. Haha <laughs> that's right. 
What other kind of job groups should we have? I mean, like... Of course, we can have the haulers. We can have... We could have just a butcher and holy crap, is there a siege going on right now? Oh my god, somebody killed the spider! It's horrifying! Okay, we win. Is that it? Siege! Yeah, apparently that was it. Oh, autosave. Yeah, that's 20 minutes. <clears throat> oh, there's another one! Go, go, go! <sighs> Dude, we are so pwned right now. Uh, our happiness is only nine. We'll work on happiness next time, because we really need to get that up so we can get some more citizens. So we can, you know, make them do stuff faster. Because <laughs> this is horrible. They should have already had this done. Yeah. <laughs> Lord. Hmm. Okay. So, that's the... T I mean, the town's coming along. I think it's coming along nicely. What do you think? Uh, let me know in the comic comments. Tell me. Be like, your town looks great. Or your tree farm sucks. <laughs> I'm okay with this. <laughs> I just want to know. <laughs> Alright, so. Enough of that. That should probably be the last of... Yeah, this should end right about now. <sighs> okay. I'm probably gonna go watch TV. <laughs> be lazy. You know. Good old stuff. I'm gonna need some more. Yeah, we need more people in these jobs. Uh, but yeah. So there, there you go. That's how you make jobs. It's pretty, pretty awesome. I, there has to be a way to make this guy leave. Leave. I don't know. Eh, whatever. I don't care right now. <laughs> Alright, I hope you enjoyed the video. Comment, subscribe for more fun and exciting videos on the uh, fluffy couch. I almost said awesome couch. It is an awesome couch. It's just fluffy, naturally. So, <laughs> I'll talk to you next time on the fluffy couch.